New at 10, a parent's wish is for their daughter's killer to be brought to justice. Barrett Beck's parents think the cold case is about to be solved. Katie Crowther was with them at a memorial tonight. Katie. Mike, it's been 24 years since their daughter was kidnapped and murdered, and still no one is in jail for her death. They haven't given up. They haven't gotten bitter. Instead, they're helping others like their daughter would have wanted. These plaques show Barrett Beck and list all the students who've won music scholarships in her honor. At the annual music memorial, they play to honor Barrett's memory. She loved singing. She was always singing. For Diane and David Beck, it's a small way to remember their daughter's beautiful voice. Can you imagine, well, maybe this... Maybe that's what Barrett would have ended up doing with her music career. But her life was cut tragically short. The 18-year-old disappeared in July of 1990. Her body was found in a ditch six weeks later. The pain of her death has not gotten easier with time. She has nephews now who um, ask questions about her all the time. And they just, you can tell how much they love her. And they never knew her. But now, 24 years later, police named Dennis Brantner their prime suspect. The Kenosha County truck driver has not been arrested or charged, but the Becks hold out hope. It's been a long time coming. Um, I, I, think it's, I think it's time for some dues to be paid. Justice will have... prevail regardless if he's put in prison or not. Justice will prevail. Just a matter of time. Such strong people, and you know, they do believe that an arrest is coming soon, and that will end a very painful mystery and an agonizing wait for them. Reporting live in Racine, Katie Crowther, today's TMJ4. Hopefully, police will be able to wrap up this case. Thanks, Katie.